Hello, this is Coco from Kicking Coco, and today I finally received it. I finally got my Beautylish package today. <laughs> Super excited. I've been so jealous of everyone who got their packages early just because I, I live in Canada, so it took a lot longer for me. And for some reason, it stayed in Burlington for two, three days. So, very excited, and it's gonna open this now. So, it comes in a package like this. Very, very pretty papers. Um, there's a little tag on it from Beautylish that says Lucky bags are a Japanese New Year tradition that inspires us to create our own. The owl on this year's lucky bag is said to bring luck and good fortune in Japanese culture. We hope the surprises inside fill your new year with luck, happiness, and beauty. Ooh, okay, so first item, and I'm gonna try to leave prices down below or wherever on the screen. Anyways, first item is this Becca with Light Palette Blush Trio Palette. So let's open this up and see the colors. Oh, I'm so excited to swatch this. I've seen some people get this on their Beautylish as well, and I was so jealous, so I'm happy I got this. Oh, I just dropped it. <laughs> so it comes like this. Um, let's open this baby up. Three blushes here. You have the color Wisteria, Songbird in the middle, and over here is Snapdragon. Let's just swatch these for you. Oh, if I haven't done my makeup already, I'd totally add this on, but I'm loving this. Ooh, so next is this brush shampoo by Clean Apothecary in lavender. I mean, not much to say about this. I hope I can put it to some good use. I've heard some good things about this. And next item I received is this RCMA powder. Um, I have this powder already and I'm not too fond of it. I think it's one of those items that had way more hype than it should because I've had better powders to bake with and even set with. I'm not a big fan of this and if you only if you read the ingredients, there's only two things which is terrible for your skin, talc and silica, so be careful of using this a lot. Ooh, next item. Oh my gosh, this is prob I'm really excited about this one. This is um a Natasha Denona eyeshadow palette. So I never had Natasha Denona and it came out recently too, I believe. Well, I have this version of the palette. Very shimmery, sparkly gold and gray silver colors. Not bad. Let's try to swatch this. <laughs> and I know Natasha Denona is super expensive for eyeshadows for some reason. I still have to look into that because I have no idea who Natasha Denona is and why is she overpricing eyeshadows. Uh, going in order, I'm gonna start with the gold and then moving on down. Oh, that is gorgeous. These are so amazingly pigmented, wow. Here's the middle color. <laughs> I'm running out of fingers. Okay, so I, I understand why well, I sort of understand why it's so expensive. I still think it's overpriced, but you definitely pay for what you get. And the last one here. Oh, wow. Okay, these are just amazing. Do you not see the shine on these? Wow. So I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this. <laughs> okay, next item on the list. So those are four items already, and let's see what else is in here. Ooh, okay, so next item. Um, it's this... Cosmetic It, I think? Brow Power. Now, they don't have this in Canada. I only know about it just because of my Ipsy bags. So, I think they're generally good products. I just, I'm not too familiar with them. This is a universal brow pencil in the color taupe. So let me just swatch that on my hand as well. <laughs> my hand is still very glittery from all that Natasha Denona. Okay, so it's very faint. I don't know if you can see strokes right here. It's a good color. Um, very sturdy too, this metal pen. So super excited about this and it as well. You can never go wrong with brow pencils like this. And I believe this is my last item. And this is a brush by Wayne Goss. I love Wayne Goss. I love his videos and his products. Uh, wow, it feels incredibly soft. 
I'm not too sure, but I think this is made out of uh, horse hair or something. Do not quote me on that though. Um, yeah, so that was it <laughs> for my beauty lish bag. You can probably tell that my hair is still wet. That's just because I had to jump out of the shower once I heard that my package finally arrived. So yeah, I'm fairly happy. And if you don't know about uh, beauty -ish lucky bags, it's something that they sell at the end of every year and like I said before when I read the little tag it's a Japanese tradition for a new year to have a lucky gift bag so you're gonna get mystery items with it and if you like what Beautylish carries on their site for in terms of makeup brands then you're definitely gonna be okay with your purchases <laughs> with your with your mystery gift but that being said um, it's completely random in what goes in your bags some people might get even more lucky bags compared to you so if you're if you're the type of person that's gonna get mad because someone else got better gifts then I don't think this is gonna be for you but in terms of items and a good deal, this is definitely a really good deal. <laughs> so that was my bag. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, do not forget to subscribe and check out our other videos. Until next time.